Yeah, little ah, okay, bam, bam, little 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 ah. Getting ready to talk. Are you good, Joey? I'm good. I'm good. The world's good. All right, here we go. Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Yes, we did it. We, not me, not Mr. Sinister. We, you guys out there, all of us as a collective raised over $10,000 for me to promote and manufacture and produce and pay the producers that worked on the album and, and, and all the people that helped me put this whole vision together for X-Files Lost and Deleted. You guys helped me make this a reality and I would not have made it this far without your support. I'm super choked up right now. Um, some of my closest friends know me. Uh, I could be very emotional. Uh, truth is, right now, I'm at a loss for words, but I'm going to try to find them and, and thank um, specific people that need to be shouted out in this uh, video here. Um, first and foremost, I want to thank Tamara Palmer for all her hard work. You really went above and beyond the call of duty, and I, I appreciate you for it, Tamara. You helped me get here. I don't think I would have made it this far without your expertise and knowledge and, and um, overall decisiveness about moves we need to make and when we need to make these moves. Thank you, Tamara. To my boy, Eric um, Abel, generic. Thank you, man. You've been like a brother to me for the past few years. Every time we have uh, some sort of idea that, that either you come up with or I come up with to, to do a show or tour or uh, make an album or produce a record or whatever the case is, there's always a great energy flow between the two of us. And I really appreciate that about my connection to you. And I just want to say thank you for, for uh, chipping in and helping out. Um, to my girl, Carrie Watson, you were there in the early stages of this whole process. Don't think that I forgot the, um, the way you've helped me and, and just a lot of your suggestions and putting this whole Kickstarter together, uh, worked out. And I just want to say thank you. Um, I want to say thank you to Rain, Rain, um, Linda, uh, Mike May and Dean Standing. Thank you guys for your donation. It really helped me this week uh, get closer to the 10 grand. I also want to thank my boy Dan Monopoly. Um, dude, you and I have only encountered each other a few times in person. I know that you're, you're, um, you consider yourself probably a student of this art, and, and that's the reason why you paid $500 to take a few lessons with me. Um, and I know you really don't need it, dude. And I know that that really came from your heart and you just wanted to help me reach my goal. So thank you very much, Dan. I have a long memory, dude. I will not forget it. Um, I wanna thank Rain uh, again. Thank you, sorry, I'm like all over the place right now. Rain, again, Linda, Dean, Mike May. Uh, again, you guys contributing to $500 as a scholarship for someone who can't afford to take lessons with me. That says a lot about your, your company. And um, yeah, you deserve two thank yous for that. Um, I also would like to thank Serato. Uh, I'd like to thank my boy John Carluccio for helping me out with this project. i also like to thank my boy Mr. Sinister Man. Um, Sinister is a very dear friend um, to me. And sorry, I'm kind of like at a loss of words right now. I'm just trying to find the right shit to say. But Sin, I just want to thank you, dude, for real, man. You've been there with me since 1991. You've helped me prepare for, for battles. Um, we've toured the world together, and that's why we're here today about to rehearse for more shows, man, because I value your, your, your creativity. I value you as a person, and I'm super thankful that you jumped on board to help me promote this campaign and... and yeah, man, let's let's do more stuff together, man. Yes. For real, man. Amen. So thank you. No um, also, last but not least, I actually saved this person last for 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 a reason. I got a a a, a message from a really cool 
former student of mine. We, all, we actually only had one lesson. Her name is Cynthia Cherish. And she's battling cancer right now. And she emailed me, or I should, I should say messaged me on Facebook, and was like, let me know when you reach 9,500 um, 9, uh, total for, in, you know, and in in trying to get to the 10 grand. And I sent her a message um, on Facebook. And within 10 minutes of me sending her the message, she donated $500 to my campaign and took me over the 10 grand. So I'm saving Cynthia for last because she was the last person to help me get over that hurdle. And believe me when I say that when I first started this campaign, June 15th, um, almost 10 days ago, it really felt like a big hurdle. I honestly wasn't 100% sure that I was going to raise $10,000. These days, getting people to buy music is very challenging. And for, to be completely candid with you guys, that's why I, I've, that's one of the reasons, not completely the reason, but that's one of the reasons why it's taken me so long to release another album is because I wasn't sure of the landscape with regards to the music industry and how to get my music in the hands of fans without necessarily losing money. It takes money to make an album, making music the creative process is free, but the process of manufacturing the product and putting it out costs money. And that's why I started this campaign, not to pocket anything, not to go spend money on something stupid, just to get music out there in your hands. So the fact that Cynthia came through at the 11th hour for me and, and donated $500, um, it's 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 interesting. It's ironic because I all this time, starting uh, you know end of April when I when I first decided I was gonna launch this Kickstarter campaign, I saw it as a challenge. I saw it as a battle. The real challenge, the real battle, is being fought by Cynthia Cherish. She's she's battling cancer, and she took time away from that battle to help me win my battle and i will be forever indebted to you you've made a friend for life cynthia if you ever need anything reach out i will be there within seconds and in, in just in general guys to everyone that donated all my backers thank you from the bottom of my heart this is rob swift humbly just saying to you guys that I'm very grateful for all the support, all the kind words, all the encouragement, and um, you guys ignited uh, a new faith in, in, in this art form and how widely it's accepted. People say that the art of turntablism is dying or it's dead, and this is proof that it's still alive. As long as it has a heart, as long as it has a heartbeat, it's still alive, and you guys proved that. So again, thank you very much. I love all you guys. I, I just want to hug you. I'm going to hug everybody right now. This is Brolic Arm. Thank you. Signing off. Me and Sinister are going to get back to the rehearsals. Once again, thank you guys. Peace. Love you. Thank you. All right, I'm out. You ready to practice? Go. All right, let's do it. Peace. <laughs>